and welcome back. Today we are doing a DIY project. And we're gonna make a light up beach jar. As per usual, we are just winging it. We have our LED lights, which we're gonna put the box over there. We've got some gravel, some shells that I got from the beach, some other shells that I already had, and we have some crystal beads to make the in-between kind of reflective light. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. I'm just kind of winging it, but there's like an idea that I had and I was like, I'm gonna go with it. I still have to figure out where to hide the battery pack, but let's get started. Oh, and we have some batteries for the LED lights. I'm gonna start by putting some gravel in the bottom, mixed with some vase filler. Oh, let's do it. I'm gonna start placing my LED lights kind of into the gravel, hoping that the little beads will reflect some light. There's beads and little bits of gravel everywhere because I was not careful. Yes, I tried to use kitchen tongs to uh, place my lights. In retrospect, I should have just put the lights in first. So I think I'm gonna do that. And then put the gravel back in. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. It's a couple times there I thought I was gonna get my hand stuck in the jar too. Okay, that worked much, much better. So I'm trying to get some of these ones that are all over the table in there. And then I am going to start putting my shells in. I ended up winding the cord underneath the lid of the jar and placing the battery pack on the back. No idea what this is gonna look like. Kind of looks tacky already, but let's see. Some solid dollar store batteries. That are the wrong size, so I'm gonna go to the battery drawer and get the right size because apparently I can't read and it's double A, not triple A. Good thing I always have double A on hand. Okay. All right, we have the batteries installed. Let's place the cover back on. It's upside down. And drum roll. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Let's get the lights dimmed so you can see better. I'm gonna be cleaning beads off my floor for probably the next couple hours and then I'll probably be finding them for like next couple years because they're everywhere. Thank you for watching and don't forget to uh, smash that like button. It really helps me out and subscribe. Bye!